Now, if you're looking for a good fiddle book to get the basics, you know, not too much stuff, but, uh, you know, the basic fiddle tunes that aren't too complicated and you're a beginner, then I would recommend, it's called the Fiddler's Fake Book, and I just ordered it off Amazon. And there's a link in the description you can click on. It'll bring you right here, and uh, you can purchase it. It's only, like, 18 bucks. Definitely worth it. There's over 500 different songs in here. And it's, you know, it's fairly thick, as you can see. Today I'm sharing with you the first six fiddle tunes I think you should learn as a beginner. Let's get started. Starting off with number one is Child's Grove. And this is a pretty easy piece. It's down the lower string so you don't have to worry about the squeaky notes up high. Now the next piece on my list is called A Shokin Farewell. And this is a fairly famous fiddle tune and it helps work on connectedness throughout your notes, if that's a word. And it really makes you focus on the intonation, so that sounds perfect. The next tune I think you should learn is called the Butterfly by O'Carolyn, and it's a fairly basic piece, but it's really fun to experiment with, add notes on, take notes out that don't sound perfect, and just put your own twist on it. The next song is called O'Carolyn's Concerto, and it's a, it's a fairly long piece. And it's important to learn how to memorize pieces as a violinist or a fiddler. And uh, so here it is. Now the fifth piece I chose is called Devil's Dream, and this is a super fast piece with lots of string crossings, and that's one of the most, you know, wanted skills is to be able to play fast, so here it is. And the last piece is called Banish Misfortune. And it's a very unique piece, and it kind of has a weird, I don't know, something's weird about it. But it, it really comes together, you know, it works out in the end, but it's just, it's important to learn how to play pieces that aren't unusual in the keys, like G. This one's in like the key of like F flat major or something weird. So uh, here it is.